Hey everyone, Zef here, and welcome to Questcraft Overview. Well, I had something else planned for today, but this shit blew up so fast that I cannot not do a video on it. Essentially, this is the most exciting news we've had since this year started. Meta is so slow and stagnant nowadays that the modders and indie devs have to do all the work. So long story short, Questcraft is essentially a Java version of Minecraft designed for Quest. It doesn't support a lot of VR mechanics we're used nowadays. It's basically a graphical emulation of the world with some binary inputs that pretty much simulates the PC experience but on your head. I'm not gonna hide I'm no expert in Minecraft nor the biggest fan of it just like with any survival, though performance wise it was running quite well. You can't really set a long drawing distance since that will cut your frame rate real fast, so if you stick with the settings of seeing things in your proximity then the whole experience will feel like you're immersed in the world. I've not really tried any other version of Minecraft for VR, but this quest version specifically doesn't seem really that bad. I would think any fan of this game would literally drool over the fact that you can play it now on standalone and connect with other people and servers in multiplayer if that's your thing. A lot of people were asking for it for years now and out of the blue yesterday we suddenly got it. Which seems to be the best news we've got for Quest for now. I guess let's just jump into it. Well I guess we'll create a new world though I hope my headset won't explode in doing so. <laughs> well that definitely took a couple minutes. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's gonna be like the smoothest we'll get. Let me just see some settings. This is like the bare minimum though something's going on with the world. I guess we have to stay with the original settings because anything else just doesn't work. How even we do stuff? We have jumping, alright. Like it's a left click on the PC, how to put it. Okay, so with right trigger you perform an action and left you put it. Whatever you have on your hand though, it shows on the right, but you put with the left. So I'm not like an avid Minecraft player. I have literally no idea what's the difference between Java version, Bedrock, like all those things. I reduce the minimum, like I don't need to see the whole world. <laughs> For the frame rate, it's worth it now. Pitting you in 60 FPS. <laughs> So like I said, I don't really know much about Minecraft. I think it's just all about survival and stuff. The first thing you have to do is just to, I guess, craft and set up your home. Yeah, that's how the Minecraft journey starts. <laughs> just basically that. That's kind of crazy now. Like, we have Minecraft for Quest. Of course, it's not really with the right VR movements. It's essentially the base game like you would play on your PC and just pointing things. I think the crafting table was something like that. How to separate though? Trigger drag. Okay. Well, that's not it. Wait, do I not remember correctly how it is? Or maybe it's from wood actually. Oh, I didn't know we had recipes. Mind you, the last time I played Minecraft was, I don't want to be incorrect, maybe 10 years ago. So we didn't have all this. We had to think about what we could craft from the Wikipedias and stuff. Yeah, here we go. That's the first thing. <laughs> and use it. Okay, well, I guess sword, pickaxe, this sort of stuff. A lot of things are like attacking my eyes because even though Minecraft is pixelated by itself, some edges on the windows and on the enemies are like microscopic epilepsy, like the early days of VR. And that's pretty much the basics from what I know. Just chapu chapu. <laughs> Like I'm not made for survivals at all, like it's not my genre, I get lost very easily, not knowing just what to do and like I need to be guided <laughs> and have a point to play. Though if you finesse some things and set the settings for whatever preference you have then you're gonna have a good time with it. It's not actually that bad as a lot of people were saying. No, 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 you are not getting from here alive. And I think after the dark we'll have monsters show up. That should be fun. I need to go back to my crafting table. Let's build something. The render drawing distance will be pretty much the biggest struggle in this game. Like you have to set yourself some lights or guidance where was what. I thought there's like a permanent music in Minecraft though. It's so peaceful and quiet. Here's the night. Well, are my zombies and skeletons. It's also like you have to spend a lot of time in those games to make it worthwhile doing a video. Here they are. <laughs> in VR it should be so easy. Ow. Oh, playing. Ow, oh, okay. <laughs> I can't judge the distance. 
<laughs> so easy playing Minecraft. Like VR changes the gameplay so much because you are the person doing things, not behind the keyboard. You have a way different perception of anything really. Like a lot of things that you think are challenging are not in VR. Though automatically the immersion is just multiplied. <laughs> Everything, at least for me sometimes, is just a horror scenario. But well, here we are with the soundtrack. The first deluxe apartment from dirt. Jesus. <laughs> okay. It's not as dramatic. Oh, we have some skellies in the background. <laughs> I wonder how dodging the arrows from them will be in VR. Easy or not? Yeah, like... The most basic things in VR. <laughs> no. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Just explode. <laughs> yeah, like. Can't cut. Ow. <laughs> Peach. Oh, I'm dying actually. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> No! <laughs> oh shit. I don't know where I was though now. This is my spawn point apparently, but... Nothing's here. <laughs> Off we go. Oh my god, not you again. I'm just passing by. <laughs> Shish. Hey! <laughs> oh my... Okay, so that's why you sleep at night. Oh, Enderman. Two. Ooh. This is a party here. <laughs> no. <laughs> Blow them. Oh shit, not him. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, yes. They won't come here, I feel like. <laughs> and we are now in the water. Yeah, I feel like just adding some, you know, additional stuff, maybe like animations or anything that's like VR related is gonna make this game amazing because the immersion is here. Like, we're actually in the Minecraft world. Hey, <laughs> is he not like resistant to water? Like, he was taking damage. I wonder if I can get. I think it's called Ender Pearl. It's like for traveling. Oh she. <laughs> yeah, like those are gonna be scary. Pascal is just teleporting. Oh, what the? Zombie, like, in the water? Yeah, we got Ender Pearl. Gimme, 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 gimme. <laughs> Hasta la vista, bitches. Uh, it's this. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Like, I don't really know how to have fun in Minecraft. Maybe it's natural sometimes when the gameplay just happens, like now. And maybe I'm gonna eat my words and this is gonna be like, I don't know, <laughs> my main playthrough doing so. But I actually don't really mind that we don't really have a lot of VR things going on. For once, because there are games that I completely mind, but Minecraft seems to be an exception because it's not necessarily about the controls, it's just being involved in the world. I think when the day is happening, then they will disappear. There's a lot of them. Holy moly. No, it's yours. <laughs> God. <laughs> I'm not dying again. To water. <laughs> And somewhere. Ow! Okay. I don't even have time to respawn, and they already traumatized me. Yeah, from close range, I can't uh, react. <laughs> it's too fast. Slalom, can I mount you? Oh. Rude. 
So that's essentially Minecraft now for Quest. It works, it is what it is. Sure, you can expect more from it and maybe the developers will add features <laughs> along the way. But like for a passion project, not really being your game initially, it's pretty fun. And also I've heard you can play multiplayer, so it has a lot of features ready to just enjoy.